Um, as you can see, the boys are back to school today. Hip hip hooray! Now we've got to go and buy for three birthdays. I know. Um, yeah, so, um, <coughs> the potato tube, I think oh. they got bored towards the end. Oh, and I was looking forward to getting back to school. Um, because obviously the weather hasn't been exactly that great. So, we'll be able to go out very much. And indoor places will just be too bad to build real cope with it. Yeah, I think the hay fever starts to kick in. And then obviously, so they're back to school then for. Was well, about to school for two weeks, isn't it? Then they're off for bank holiday Monday, which is a day. Seven And then they're back to school then for two weeks, and they're off then for the week. But that week we're off down to Weymouth. It's been about three weeks, sure. It's not three weeks. It was about three weeks, I don't know. Yeah. 20, but, 25th of May, they're breaking. Oh, yes, yeah, about three weeks. And you see, like Sue said, we're just off to Banbury today to do some birthday shopping. Got my sisters on the 19th, Mum's the 20th, and then Sammy's on the 21st. So, yeah. Expensive, eight pounds expensive month for birthday presents. So yeah, so come shop with us today at Banbury. Stones now. Sammy likes the books with the CD, isn't he? No, so see, there's any here. Many you don't see many of them, do you? Really? Because you know what he likes to do. He likes to listen to it. Then he follows along with the book. That's what he does. He reads the book while he's listening to the story. There you go. Look, three little monkey. Oh, we go. Book and CD. There you go. Mm, she got one. Yeah, that book and CD. Mm. Um. It's this one. The koala who could. Neon Lion, the three audio. Is the same book as CD on there? Book and CD? Yeah, yeah. On there, I don't know. So, I don't know if he likes these books, he reads these things. But then again, they've got on the Oxford Reading Tree level books he's on. 
That's the thing. I don't know. There you go. See what there is around here. See what there is around here. There you go, Oxford Reading Tree. I don't think they've got its level near, have they, those ones? I can't the five confident reads say five to eight. No, it's not those ones. Oh, yeah, go off Wesley, or. I think I've got these ones here. Oh, they're seven year olds, it's seven, though, is he? Like C's, isn't he? No, she rhymes with another. There you go. There you go, so this is I quite like that one. Oh, that's a Paddington one. There's a Paddington one. Oh, yeah, it's nice. That's it nice, isn't it? We are in Toys R Us. It closes on Friday. It's quite sad to see Toys R Us go, you know, isn't it? Yeah, if you can't keep up with the times, then that's what happens. Well, must admit, I've got a couple of cheapy bargains there for the 75th day. We've got the toilet treble game. And we've got my Thomas thing. What's it? It's a... Uh, it's fire range and squirts water or something, doesn't it? Mm. So yeah, so it's quite sad to see it go. Have they got any? I know there's the baby cups, oh, aren't yeah, they? The brains that turn us into a Smith's toy store. Exactly. Yeah. Um, looking for any birth? They've got the birthday cards, have they? No, they're putting the what? The shells are nice, aren't they? Yeah, yeah shells are nice actually. Yeah. What are they? Thirty-five. Even the fixtures and fittings are going. It's quite sad. Wooden pegs, these are quite nice. I don't know if I've got anything the boys' names on still. So, but yeah. Hasn't been here long, has it been? Yeah, hasn't even been here a year. Less than a year, isn't it? But it's, it's nationwide, or it's worldwide, because even in the States it's going. But, what's that? Paw Patrol safety batteries? <laughs> One of the £2.17. I'll just get those, I think, yeah. To get Ben, Ben, Sammy, um, a toilet travel game and a little Thomas set, didn't we, for his track master track he's got. They come to just £10, that's what it come to. It's quite sad to see Toys R Us go, <clears throat> but what can you do? Hmm? Yeah. I think Amazon's called the High Street to be honest. So, how is it? So, how is it just to go click, 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 wait for it to be delivered, you know? Yeah. They don't, do they? But anyway, so obviously just popping up to CX now, see if they've got any cheapy games. And because we got a £5 voucher, because we sold some DVDs a few weeks ago and there's nothing we wanted. We're heading up to the retail park now, see if we can go to Primark, aren't we? I do, it's very sad that over the last so many years you've seen all these shops disappear. I know. This was one of the high, obviously, Woolworths was the start of it when Woolworths went down under. I'm about to say, I still miss Woolworths. I do actually. Well, well yeah, being there is a bit like a Woolworths, so I didn't want this. But anyway, yeah, um, but internet and online is just Amazon's killed the high street. Everything's killed it. It has. But anyway, as so I was saying, it's just up to Primarks now. Um, we had to look round in Banbury. We couldn't find nothing for my mum and my sister, could we? No. Um, managed to get a few things to Sammy, which is great. Um, and hopefully he's going to love his toilet trouble game because I believe it squirts water in your face or something. So he'll enjoy that. And also the Thomas thing. Again, we got that from Toys R Us. And he paid us so 10 quid for the both of them, I think it were, which is like really good. Um, yeah, so hopefully, fingers crossed, we'll find something for mum and my sister in Primarks. Fingers crossed we can park, obviously. Heading into Primarks. Um, hopefully, Stephen can't open the door. The door working. That's it. We'll grab a basket. So, let's see what there is to buy, shall we, in here for them. The only problem I find with Primark is to come in for one thing, you know, spending the fortune, don't you? Please, the clothes are not that great. You saw for yourself from those trousers I bought, all those the bits blue, come the off. bits come out the bottom. It's just really... The thing is, they're cheap though, aren't they? Yeah, it's just throw away to see. Yeah, that's what it is. So, see what there is. Brandy. As soon as there's anything, I pay for Sammy. They're not bad, look. The t-shirts and shorts, £1.80. What we do? I know. Yeah. The thing is, that's quite nice. Little he's vest. got a mountain of clothes at home he's not using. Though. He has got that. He tell you one thing he does do, he does do some stuff, I do have to admit that, but I need to sort it all out first. Oh yeah. You need to find if he's got some stuff to wear. That's what I'm saying. Oh yeah, because that's imagine the salmon in a pair of those. Does he need any of those? He does need shorts and t shirts, I do have to not t shirts, he needs shorts. You get him the pair then. Oh, I want to see what he's got first. Look, imagine that colour. You know it's like you. Um twelve to thirteen. 
Nia's like though, Nia likes to pick his own clothes now. He's got to age where he doesn't like mummy and daddy picking his clothes, he wants to pick his clothes himself. So, oh, that's it Ben. That's it Ben, really nice that was. I think they're good off for £2.50 for a t-shirt. They're quite nice these are. These would be ideal for Ben, you know what I mean? So just buying Sammy a pair of shoes. Not bad actually, are they really? I can't believe he's in a size 7, he's got bigger feet than me. Mm. Well even Ben has, Ben's a size 13, getting a size 14. Mm. You know what, that was, you know what, be honest with you. That will suit you. Don't you don't wear jeans though, do you? Mm. There you go. It's not bad, it's £5 for a top. Oh no, it's ridiculous, isn't it? Mm. There you go, two pound fifty for a t-shirt. You can't wear these. What? These during the summer months because they just sweat on you. Exactly, I know. What, what is the point? Exactly, you no. Know? <coughs> you wouldn't wear that, it wouldn't get a lot. You wouldn't lose the world in that, would you? Mm. So what have I got around here? What do I? Well, they're not very. Oh, they look like that is. Yeah, okay, well, we've got a pair of these. What is, what is wearing now? Mm. What these ones? Would you rather get in those ones? It's got on. It's a pair of size seven trainers, yeah. More vulnerable. They're, but they're not. The bottoms they're aren't there. Strong. They're not very strong, are they? I prefer yeah. those actually. What are those ones? They're not quite great, aren't they? No. It's just a recyclable shop, isn't it? Look how cute these little bags are for little girls. What they're quite cute, aren't they, these ones? What else have I got around here? They're in the home section. Oh, look at those Hulk, look, those Harry Potter cushions. They're quite cool, aren't they? Avery I'm looking at. Oh, look. Mm. Look at my cute. You've got some duvet covers. I think they're quite cute, they are. All Harry Potter stuff. Be Becca better not come near, I'm sure. You know what I mean? Please. What's that, a teapot? What's that, a cup? Oh, it's a cup. <laughs> That's what we need for the boys. Like, clean up after yourself. How else the elves don't work here? There you go, get me a shovel of those for birthday. Oh, good day. She knows Harry Potter, doesn't she? Quite nice, aren't they? Very good fibre. Quite nice, actually. Those ones there, <laughs> we've got Mercy Levy. I hate buying presents to people when they don't think they know what they want, you know what I mean? All they say is to surprise you. Okay, head into all these. Look, aren't these quite cute? All the, all the Disney range. You know what I mean? I look. Thing is, this bag is asking me things I like. You know. So look, look. Some say better. I quite like those. I think they're so nice. And the, what's that? The Looney Tunes things there. And the Mickey Mouse there. Look, they're quite nice. Naughty, I'm the creaky sneaking McDonald's on without the kids. <laughs> um, I couldn't resist getting another one of these. That the cream egg McFlurries. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Uh, that's what happened. Good get. I've got Coke Zero. So you really can have really now, isn't it? That's what you can have now. Yeah, got nothing else, can you? Mm. And see if they got one thing on the um, Monopoly. Oh, look. Coffee one. Anything nice? Anything? If not, what have you got? The, uh, the What's, What's that? Oh, what are they? Nothing interesting, are they? Past four now. Just waiting for the boys to come home from school. Hopefully they've had great days and they behaved themselves. I know Sam was looking forward to going back to school, and Bill was okay. So yeah, so let you know how they got on. Well, they're both home from school now. Um, Simon's had a really great day. He's glad to be back. A um, few problems with Ben. A few tears from his ears again. We really didn't know what to do with him. Um, so obviously we had a few bad days from the holidays. So maybe it's all main things. I don't know. Uh, maybe it might be worth speaking to his paediatrician. We'll see him in a few weeks. See what he suggests. Might be worth finding it. Okay, yeah. from there. But we do think it is trap wind. Because it seems to be a time he banged his ears. Um, we give some great water and stuff like that, or a drink, and he seemed to have burped and stuff, so we do think it is that. Anyway, they've come home with school photos, so now comes the fun part. I decided what photos to have. So here are um, 
Sammy's photos. This is a really, really nice. I think that one and that one are my favourite. And the thing is, they do them in black and white. So yeah, how much? They're not too bad actually, really. Or how much they are. Anyways, here's a Ben's. Nice. So here are Ben's. Obviously, Ben doesn't yeah. smile on requests. These are quite natural poses. It's got that one. Go that one. That one. Got that one. That yeah. one and that one. I'm not too quite sure at Ben's at Ben's at the minute. Yeah, I think obviously it'll probably be that one because it's more looking natural at the camera, I think. So, but it would be nice though, we've been told they were doing them because we could have had one of them together. That would have been nice. Yeah, I've got Mr. Ben with me tonight. <laughs> yeah, you've been a happy boy, haven't you? Come home from school and won't straight outside his trampoline. He likes it, he likes it this time of year, then we can go outside after school. Don't you, Ben? So he absolutely loves his trampoline, the best thing we ever brought from Plum. And we had one given for, two for our um, charity, um, but sadly it didn't last very long. But anyway, this one from Plum, he absolutely loves it. It's 10, 10 foot, 12 foot, I think it is. Oh, it's, it's big enough for the both boys. Anyway, so this one says, thanks for watching today. You wave it, oh, Ben, you wave it. In. Um, so this one say thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And then we'll see you tomorrow for... Wednesday. It's like the day there. Bye. Bye. There's a magical place. We're on our way there. With toys in the millions all under.